This is just teaching her that something could be around her feet, her legs, and she's not going to kick out. What we're doing is just swinging the rope around her legs, not hard, just nice and easy. And that way she could get the feel of something on her legs. So if she was to strike out, it would be striking out at the rope and not at us. belly. Good. Good. We want her to stand still and every time she moves he's just going to move with her. He's just showing her that what he's doing it's not going to hurt her. He's not going to hurt her. He's gaining her trust. I like how she's standing still. We want them to stand still so that way they understand that we're not going to hurt them. So what he's doing right here is he's applying pressure. He's not pulling or anything but he's applying pressure on that rope. And then once she turns her muzzle, yields her muzzle, then with the rest of the lead rope, he's just applying pressure. And all he's asking for is one step to the side. This will transfer down to when she gets a, um, this will help her lead better, but also this will also help her understand when she gets a bit in her mouth. We're just asking for that step. Release. Good. Now pet her. Good job. Okay, next side. Move off to the side more. There you go. There you go. Don't pull. There you go, release. Don't worry about that. Right here, we're just having her step on a tarp because it's something scary. And the moment 
he puts pressure on her, he will keep the pressure on her, and the moment she takes even one little step, he will release to let her know that what she's doing is good, and he's going to reward her by petting her. Sorry about the airplane. <laughs> Good girl. <laughs> okay, come on. Come on, wait. Come on. Come on. See if you can just walk her. There you go. Good. Now pet her. See if you could walk up to the tarp, bud. There you go. Good girl. Okay. Go ahead and get her going more. Good. Girl. 